Check that ACS is clean and in good condition and hoses are retained. Fully slackened waist belt and shoulder straps ready for use. Check that the red bypass knob is turned off and press the black rubber reset button. Check the orange o-ring is clean and in good condition. Check the face mask is clean and undamaged. Slowly open cylinder valve fully and allow 10 seconds for the apparatus to pressurise. Check the pressure gauge shows the cylinder to be at least 80% full, 240 bar for 300 bar cylinders, 160 bar for 200 bar cylinders. Listen for leaks. Close the cylinder valve and monitor the pressure gauge for one minute. If the reading falls by more than 10 bar during this time, there is a leak that requires rectification. With the set pressurised but the cylinder turned off, Open the red bypass knob on the DV slightly to vent air from the system. Check that the whistle sounds clearly at 55 bar, plus or minus 5 bar. Ensure the set is vented by closing cylinder valves and opening a demand valve bypass knob. Undo the cylinder connector. Open the cylinder band buckle by depressing both blue buttons and lifting the black over centre latch. Place fully charged cylinder on the back plate and connect the cylinder outlet to the cylinder on the reducer. Slide the buckle back to its original position and lock the black over centre latch into place. Check the cylinder is secure, if not, tighten band further. Connect the demand valve to the face mask and check that the red locking catch engages fully. Rotate the demand valve gently to confirm that it is engaged. Fully slacken all head harness straps. With the face mask connected to the demand valve, check that all face mask straps are fully slackened. Fully slacken shoulder straps and waist belt. Pass right arm through the right shoulder strap and swing the set across the back. Slip left arm through the left shoulder strap. Hang face mask round the neck by its neck strap. Pull down on both shoulder strap adjusters until the apparatus fits comfortably. Close the waist belt, tighten for comfort and tuck away excess webbing. Slowly open the cylinder valve and check the pressure gauge to ensure that the cylinder is at least 80% full. Hold the head harness lower straps and place chin in chin cup. Pull mask harness straps over back of head, ensuring that straps are not twisted and no hair is trapped under face seal. Tighten straps in sequence, bottom, middle, top. Do not over tighten. Inhale deeply to activate the demand valve, then breathe normally. Insert a finger under the face seal and check for a steady outward flow of air. Remove finger and allow mask to reseal. Close the cylinder valve and keep hold of the hand wheel. Hold breath for 10 seconds and listen carefully for any sound of leakage. Check pressure gauge reading for any signs of leakage. Readjust face mask if any leakage is detected and repeat test. With cylinder valves still closed, slowly breathe down the system and check that the whistle sounds clearly at 55 bar, plus or minus five bar. Fully open cylinder valve. Check that cylinder valve is fully open and that the gauge shows sufficient air. Turn bypass knob on and check for steady airflow. Close bypass. Once fully satisfied with the apparatus, proceed to undertake tasks required. To reset the demand valve, take a deep breath and depress black button on demand valve. To remove the face mask, release all head harness buckles by pulling forward. Remove mask and let it hang from neck strap. Close the cylinder valve Open the DV bypass knob. When airflow stops, turn bypass to off. Release the waist belt buckle. Slacken shoulder straps by pulling up metal buckles and remove the apparatus. Clean and check the apparatus prior to being returned to service.